Hello guys, my name is Joseph Mechler. I'm the product manager of the new Double R and I'm very happy to introduce you the new ergonomics of the bike. We have built the handlebar brand new. We make it a little bit higher, a little bit wider, so we have a nice positioning if you are braking as well in the fuel tank. It's not, it's really thin, so we have a lot of support during braking and acceleration and moving in the corners. Then the new footrests are machined uh, with a lot of grip. Everyone is asking for a super bike for a lot of torque and a lot of power. The single R from BMW Motorrad has a lot of torque and the double R has a lot of power. The brand new engine is combined both torque from the single R and power from the double R. I would like to introduce you to BMW Shift Cam. What you see here is the normal camshaft of the double R, the old one. The new one has a shift cam. What is the difference? It's this part, this little part. It shifts at 9,000 RPM in five milliseconds and it shifts eight millimeters. So the perfect combination for road and for race track. <music> Cornering is one of the coolest stuff on a bike. I would like to show you today the new dynamic damping control. Here we see the new system. It works parallel, that means we have the the maximum damping in the system and if you need less damping it works in 10 milliseconds. And here we see the shim package. Every chassis engineer can adapt it to your demand in terms of rider scale, weight and speed. This thing is the big deal. Let's talk about the 6.5 inch full color DVD dashboard from BMW with the multi controller where you can adjust everything. You can go with the menu button to the settings, press it again, and then you come to the configuration, go with the multi controller to the right side, and now you see the configurations. Let's check it. So, what we see is now we have the Race Pro 1 and we have Race Pro 1 two and three. What means that? So that means that you can make your own configuration. Let's jump in the menu and let's see what is in the engine mode. So engine is on one. With the multi-controller you can choose four different kinds of engine levels. Engine brake. An engine brake have level one, level two, level three, different kind of engine brakes. Traction control, DTC, dynamic traction control. Now you see we are on level four. We are in the rain mode. Turn the multi-controller, you go to the road, high stability, dynamic, high performance, and the source race, maximum performance. This is dynamic traction control. So, what is about wheelie? Wheel is a, a function included in dynamic traction control. So, you see, easy multi-controller. Zero means no support, no wheelie support, so you have to do your own wheelie and control it. One, high wheelie possible minimum support. Source is rain, slightly wheelies, a lot of performance. Four. So, and ABS, so you see ABS, it's always the color you can see on the color, what kind of settings do you have, setting one, setting two, three, four, and five. And in the end, DDC, dynamic damping control, front damping is now rebound and compression on eight, Rebound, jump in, choose your damping. High number means high damping. Low number means low damping. Rebound, same for rebounds. What you can see, if you press the menu button, then you can jump in the sport. There you get your core screen. And on the core screen, you have a nice ref meter. You have a lean angle, which you can see your lean angle from the right, left side braking, deceleration, and here on the top you can really quick jump from one mode to another. So that means race mode or race pro one or two or three. So guys, 
Enjoy your track time with the double R.